tree, so it's hard to see. Oh, yeah. Now, I wonder what Wilson sees. Let's go find out. Now, if we go west, we're actually going to be able to pass by the Kobe Rock. Now, Kobe is an Afrikaan word meaning little head. It's a lookout point for animals such as lions. Now, guys, lions are inactive for about 18 to 20 hours out of the day, and they are nocturnal. A few hours that they are active is usually at night time. Not sure if we're going to get a chance to see one, but I want to look just in case. Now, at night, a female will crawl to the hind point on that rock formation to look out for prey. You see, it is a problem to go out and do the hunting. Males get to stay home and take care of the cubs. Oh, and look at this. Isn't he beautiful? Laying down right there. Now, guys, as he gets older, that means you see, will start to get darker and darker. And when he's full grown, can lift his nose, and the tip of his tail will reach about 12 feet in length. Definitely a baby of the jungle. Looks like there's a lioness up there as well, laying right next to him. Now, these animals live together in what's called the pride of lions. That's where that term pride rock comes from. About 40 or so will live together. Now, guys, a female is called a lioness, and a baby is called a cub. But can you guys think of another name for a male lion? You all heard it. It's actually Simba. It's a Swahili word. And up ahead, it looks like there are some large burrows. These are made by the largest burrowing land mammal, a warthog. Now, at night, warthogs will back into their burrows, keeping their razor-sharp tusks facing outward as a way to help ward off predators. However, I'm not seeing anything. Whoa, 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 whoa.